here are bars one and two and there's a repeat sign so we're going to come back to this this is the beginning of the a section that's why we have this a in a box there's an a section and a b section it's a nice straightforward tune this one is lovely to play lovely to learn uh, and this first bar we're going to start with the note g our home note second finger because we're in pause minus one and we're going to do push pull push on that button so you can see a dagger underneath this note and this note Again, peculiar to my music. If you see that, it means you don't have to repress the button for these notes with the daggers on. You can press once and get three notes from that single press with a push, pull, push. Like that. And then we go to the button below, still pushing to get the note B, finger three. Come back to the button above, pull out to get the note A. That was the second note we played, finger two. And then pushing again on that same button to get G. So in notes, we've got... G A G B A G. A little bit faster than that then. And above we've got the bass line. Capital G, lowercase g, capital G, lowercase g. Capital G means G bass. That's that button there. Button four on the outside row. I use my fourth finger. And then uh, this lowercase g is the G chord and it's the button above pushing. So G bass, G chord. Now you see it comes on beats one, three, four, and six. So you have this. Oompa, 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 oompa. Notice it's got that swing, that rumpty tumpty feel. Now when you've got these pull notes here, you've obviously got to make sure there's no basses because you'll have uh, a D bass or a D chord which you don't want. So you've got to keep lifting in the middle. Put that together. Let's put that pickup bar on the beginning of that. And you're beginning to get the idea of what we're aiming for. Let's look at bar two here. And it's changed position. It's moved down one into pos H, the home position I mentioned that earlier. So we're now here on this instrument, it's buttons four, five, six, seven. If you've got a third button start instrument, in other words, if your third button down is G on the push, you'll be one up from this. We've got B, D, G, and then D, B, G. So B, D, G, D, B, G. So it's all on the push, uh, up and down a G major chord. Remember, all the notes on the push give us notes found in the chord of G major. And again, you've got your rumpty tumpty G major chord, G bass, G chord, G bass, G chord. So all on the push. Let's put that together from the pickup bar. You've got out one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six. And you can see the two beats split here. Three quavers, three quavers, three quavers, three quavers. Pretty straightforward. Let's scroll down and we can see bars three and four as well. <laughs> 